Okay, we're back here with Arms Unlimited, and today we thought we'd do something different, kind of get away from the machine guns and the select fire stuff, and do a video on the venerable Glock 17. And then we decided that that would be kind of ridiculous because that's not what we're known for. We're known for machine guns. We're known for select fire stuff. So we put the Glock 17s away, and we're going to do a video on Glock 18s. And a matter of fact, you got a Glock 18 and a Glock 18C. And these are not like most Glock 18s that you see on the, on the internet where the conversions, where someone takes like a Glock 17 and converts it to, to select fire. These are real Glock 18s, standard model and the C. All right, let's talk about what makes a Glock 18 a Glock 18 and, and what is it? Um, it's a Glock 17 that's select fire. So it fires in semi-automatic and fully automatic. The selector, on the left side of the slide, on the left-hand side. You have a lever here in the up position. It fires like a normal Glock 17. Semi-automatic. Every time you press the trigger, you will fire one round, resets, semi-automatic trigger pull. When you turn the selector downward, it's now in fully automatic mode. And those are the two settings for it, either semi-automatic or fully automatic. Other than that, there is no difference on the outside between a Glock 17 and a Glock 18. You can use the traditional Glock 17 mags, but what is normally encountered in the Glock 18 will be a 17 round mag with a plus two extension or a plus three extension, or the mag that was actually designed for this gun is your 33 rounder. That's typically what you're gonna find in a Glock 18. Moving to the 18C, the features are the same, but this one's ported. And the idea behind this, because it is fully automatic, this can be a little difficult to control, although in the world of fully automatic, uh, semi-automatic pistols and, and weapons like this that are select fire, it will climb on you. So Glock developed the C model that's gonna keep the muzzle down a little bit better. And we'll see that when we hit the range with these things. Um, so this is your C model. Again, same operation, up, semi-automatic, down, fully automatic. Other than that, they're identical. Um, bit quite rare, especially in the United States. Um, and like we said before, there are guys that will take a 17 and convert it, and, and that's cool. Um, but at Arms Unlimited, they like to keep everything real. Um, they don't like converting stuff. They don't like, you know, kind of a mock-up. They want to bring everybody the real gun. So these are the real Glock 18, real Glock 18C. Next thing we're going to do, head out to the range, and we're going to shoot both of these. Okay. We're gonna go live fire with the Glock 18. From the left side of the gun, rear of the slide is your selector. Right now it's in the auto position. We'll start off shooting a couple semi-automatic rounds. In semi-auto, this weapon behaves identical to a Glock 17. There's no difference in the way that it fires and functions. So we'll go ahead and rotate to the range. I'll move the selector to semi-auto, introduce a magazine, charge it, and from here you're gonna see it's gonna fire like a normal Glock pistol. Locks the rear, typical Glock pistol, smooth, reliable, nice trigger. Now, we'll go ahead and load and make ready, but we'll switch it to auto, and I'll fire off a couple of controlled bursts. In the world of what they call machine pistols, this one's probably definitely at the top of the heap in terms of reliability and controllability. So it's quite a handful, being that it's a, basically a fully automatic handgun, but being a Glock and being very well designed, it's actually quite controllable for what it is. So, gun's loaded, we're on uh, full auto mode here with the selector, and I'm gonna fire a couple controlled bursts. And there we go, we go to slide lock. Not bad, about when you get about the five or six round out of the gun, that's when it really starts climbing, but three to six round range, very controllable, you can keep it on target. Okay, we're back out here with the Glock 18. We're gonna go ahead and do a 30 round mag dump with this weapon. This is the, the Glock 18 is the reason these extended mags were made for in the first place. These are 33 round mags. We've got about 30, 31 rounds in this, in this gun, in this magazine right now. We're going to go up into the well, load it. It's already on uh, auto position. Because I'm going to do a pretty long mag dump, I'm going to kind of accentuate my movement. I'm going to bend the front knee, get my chin heavy over my knee, and really kind of bear down on this. And if I do that, it's going to stay pretty controllable, even in auto, with 30 rounds. Let's see how it looks. So as you 
you can see, very controllable weapon, testament to Glock's ingenuity, and a very rare gun. There's a lot of full auto conversion Glocks out there where people take a Glock 17 and convert it to auto, but there's not a lot of real factory produced Glock 18s, and Arms Unlimited has several of these in inventory. So this is the real deal, guys.